So we are getting ready to do my room tour. Woo -hoo. So I'm gonna be pretty stationary. I'm just gonna roll the camera around and show you a little bit of what my room looks like. So hop along for the ride. So right here is the door. Yeah, it's pretty simple. Doesn't really have much on it, but um, I always keep the blinds closed because, you know, you don't want you don't want creepy, creepy people to look up look in. Over there is a nice little picture of um, that, and um, yeah, then I have this curtain that I close pretty much 95% of the time. And then on this part of the wall, we've got a sharp spin for any sharps and things that we have to throw away. Then the thermostat for the room, which is turned all the way down, but it's still really hot, so it's okay. Um, then you can see part of my bed, but we'll talk about that later. Then over here we have a little sink area there's some lights over there pretty simple not much to say about it's really just a sink and a mirror and some toiletries and stuff like that and then I always like to keep a trash can close to the sink in the vanity because you know when you're washing your hands and you pull off paper towels and stuff you gotta throw them away then over here we have the door to the bathroom, but I won't bore you with that because it's literally just a bathroom. But on this door we have expect to check signs, silent, silent hospital help healing, and um, like procedure expectations, blah, 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 blah. And then there's a little whiteboard that keeps me up to date on um, what day it is and what my doctors are. And, what my nurses' names are and stuff like that, so that's pretty fun. Then over here we have this little chair in the corner. Um, I don't have a super great view. There's a lot of construction going on, so I only keep the window like half open because I want some daylight. But you know, I don't want I don't want to see a whole bunch of sweaty construction people. So that's my chair. I go and I sit in it sometimes when I get tired of being in the bed, but yeah, pretty standard, pretty standard chair. And over here I've got this little cabinet thing. Um, I don't really think there's anything in there. Probably just some extra pillows and stuff, but very handy to have a little cabinet next to you. Then I have my little side table, which is really nice. I like to keep a little bucket for things that need to be thrown away because, you know, never know. Then I keep my hairbrush, my mask, some Kleenexes, the phone, my laptop, I'm watching some YouTube videos. And then in the very middle of the room is my bed. Um, pretty standard bed, um, uh, rises up and down as you can see on this, and then it's got my call bell on it, um, yeah, and then I've got my big pillow, and me, and yeah, that's pretty much my whole bed, pretty, pretty simple. Not much to say about it. Then, as you come around this way, you'll see my IV pole, which has got some medicine running. So, yeah. Then over in this little corner, there's some more storage. Most of that's just like medical supplies. And a little shelf to keep things on. Then a little chair that I've got my bag in that's got some extra clothes for me. Then the computer for 
people to use to log in. Then some hand sanitizer on the wall. Another trash can, just so we can throw away all of my pills and um, stuff that I'm not using, or et cetera, et cetera. So yeah. Like I said, guys, this is um, pretty simple. You know, there's not a lot to say about this room. Oh, I do have a TV up there and a web in the corner, so that's cool. But, um, yeah, pretty standard room. Not much to say about it, but. Okay, so, if you haven't caught on by now, <laughs> obviously, I am in the hospital. So... Yeah, that's a thing. Um, I've been here since Monday, which was the 10th of May. I don't know. I can't keep up with the days. But um, I'm having some rejection, so I have to be monitored and given lots of IV medication and stuff like that. So... For this week's video, we are doing this little mock of my room tour, and then hopefully I'll be home by Monday of Tuesday or next week, and I'll be able to um, film and edit my actual room tour so you guys can see what my room at home looks like. But thank you guys for sticking with us and for um, watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you next Thursday. Bye, friends.